I'm Shanna Skinner and I'm in the Swiss Alps. I arrived by bus in the medieval village of Sayon in Switzerland's Valais region. It is a perfect day for a pilgrimage. I'm here to walk the Ferronet path, a spiritual pilgrimage that traces the life of Switzerland's legendary outlaw, Joseph Samuel Ferronet, known as the Swiss Robin Hood. It starts in Sayon and ends at the top of a hill at the world's smallest vineyard, owned by the Dalai Lama, which was bequeathed to him and is a memorial for Ferronet. It has only three vines, the grapes are used in the production of wine that is sold to raise money for charity. The vineyard is taken care of by many celebrities and their names appear on signs. Along the path, there are 21 extraordinary stained glass stations that tell the story of the counterfeit's life. A criminal on the run who loved women, wine, and making counterfeit money and giving it to the poor. Buried in Sayon, he died in mysterious circumstances. The Valais is one of Switzerland's most important wine regions. Vehicles are not allowed to protect the vines. This is a welcoming place for silence and contemplation. As the story goes, Ferronet by now has been stripped of all material possessions. Here is the last Ferronet window, immortality. He is free. On full display is a magnificent Rhone Valley in Alps. With nothing but my camera, I feel free. After our walk, I check into my hotel, Le Bain de Sion, to relax in its thermal baths. With the sun setting, I look up to the hill where I walked amongst the vines and think of Ferronet.